Hey guys, in this video we're going to talk about gradients. So to show you a real life example, I'm going to select this uh, shape which I created, which is uh, pretty much a rectangle with this uh, slided border. And um, I'm just going to click on fill. And uh, as you can see, there is this uh, solid color uh, option over here. But if you click on it, you're going to see two options, linear gradient or radial gradient. And uh, for this example, we're going to use the linear gradient. And um, here you're, you're going to see that the two options to modify the direction of the gradient and also the uh, different width of the gradient is going to appear. And um, you can simply uh, tweak around. And if you want to change the color of one specific uh, part of the gradient, you can simply click uh, on the button in the, this uh, uh, in this part over here and um, you can simply modify it uh, directly. So this will allow you to create uh, all sorts of different uh, types of gradients and um, you can see several websites nowadays that use these uh, uh, kind of gradients. And um, so this is pretty much it for the linear gradient and now we're going on the radial gradient which uh, it's um, as, as the name uh, suggests uh, basically it's, it's using a radio um, area so this is going to uh, have like a different effect and uh, you're going to modify it by using this uh, um, ellipsis which uh, can be tweaked and uh, modified based on the type of gradient that uh, you're trying to achieve so yeah this is pretty much it uh, for this lesson. If you have any questions regarding gradients or you know any other Adobe XD uh, related questions, just let me know in the comment section below and uh, I will get back to you.